Here is a question that I have received a lot over the past years, and that is whether or not you can hook a fixture like a bathroom or a kitchen sink up to a vent pipe? And the answer is probably going to be no. Now, I'm not about to suggest it won't work just fine, but according to the plumbing codes, they're not going to be happy if you do it. A dry vent pipe, not a wet vent pipe. A dry vent is usually plumbed a little different underneath the floor slab or the raised floor, whatever you're dealing with. If you can't see the plumbing, then you're going to have to assume that it has been vented correctly for a dry vent. And that means it's going to have to have a 45 degree angle minimum coming off of the horizontal pipe here. So this one is going to be angled and come up to a 45 degree fitting. You can see it here. This is angled. However, if I wanted to make this a wet vent, I could bring this fitting off horizontally. Or for example, if this was going north and south, I could come off of the side horizontally. Not like this, not at a 45 degree angle. If I start running water down here, I'm going to create problems for the airflow. That is actually the reason why we needed the vent pipe in the first place. And I'm not going to go into a lot of details on this. I just kind of wanted to provide you with something that the plumbing code is going to suggest and the fact that there's a high probability, and I mean an extremely high probability, if this is a dry vent, that you cannot convert it into a wet vent without doing some modifications to where that dry vent connects to the drain pipe. So this setup here is actually allowing air to flow in the upper section of the plumbing pipe and the water to flow in the lower section of the pipe. If I start dumping water through both of these pipes, then I'm not going to have the air on the top. I'm going to have a section right here where the water from the sink or whatever fixture I've installed is now interrupting the airflow. And that can slow the movement of the water down to both of the fixtures. Is it going to create a clogged drain? I don't think so. And like I said, I'm not about to suggest you're ever going to have a problem with that, but there's a very good chance it wouldn't meet local building codes. And thanks for watching. Don't forget to check out some of our other videos on YouTube. And if you can't find the videos on YouTube, make sure that you visit our website to find a complete organized list of all of the videos we've made so far.